Hey everyone, welcome to today's video. Today we are doing yet another Timu haul. Um, Timu is obviously very inexpensive. There's a lot of hits and misses on there. If it's a miss, you don't really spend too much on it, so it's always fine with me. Um, but I really enjoy Timu just because you can find the most random crap on there and I don't need any of it, but I like it. So there's that. Uh, I have quite a few things here. It's kind of all different categories of just random stuff. So let's just get right into it. And yeah, um, first thing I'll show you are these earrings that I picked up. I thought they were really cute for Valentine's Day. They do have a little bit of weight to them. I'll kind of move in a little bit closer so you can see. Um, they just come with the standard like little backing to it. Um, but I think these are super cute for Valentine's Day or just for in general. And I do like them. So I'm glad that I got them. And again, they're really inexpensive. Then we have, I got this ring. So I've been trying to get like uh, some larger sizes of rings just because I like to put them on all of my fingers and they tend to only just fit on a few. Uh, this one, however, I was thinking it was going to be pretty snug on my thumb and it's very loose so I'm probably just going to have to give this to someone because it's not going to stay on my finger but it's not really anything fancy it just had like a little detail to it it's really cheap looking um, but yeah I think it was like a dollar or less than a dollar so there's that um, I got some beads I do like to make jewelry from time to time um, and I got these, so I was thinking when I picked these up, there is a glare, I apologize, that they were going to have these colors, but then some of the beads were actually going to be blank, but they all have a letter on them. So I, if you want to use them just for a name or something, then you can do it for that way, but there is no blank ones in here, unfortunately. So, but they were only a couple dollars, so I'll just add them to my little collection. I got this super cute little lip balm and it's adorable. It's a little bare. So it looks like this. Let's open it up. It says baby on it. Uh, let's see here. So it has a little keychain that it comes with, but isn't that adorable? Look at the little rosy cheeks. It's so cute. And then on the back, it just says open. Oh, it smells kind of, it smells kind of good. I don't know what that smells like, but it has like a little print on it. But yeah, I'm curious to see how that's going to work. Um, but nevertheless, it's really adorable. There's that. Um, I have some clothes here. So uh, I do love their t-shirts because I find that their t-shirts are spacey and I like to wear mine a little bit larger and they're super soft so I grabbed this one I could not resist I thought this was hilarious I will put you in a trunk and help people look for you stop playing with me so <laughs> and I like the color of it uh, I just could not resist my mom said this is a little creepy and I do wear it to work from time to time so I thought that was super funny and then you'll see a picture for that all right I did pick up some fishnet stockings this pair is has like the little gems on them. I didn't open them yet. And then I also got a glow in the dark pair and I don't know how well they glow. I got them for an excision concert that was coming up to go with my outfit. Um, so that is why I have them. And they always seem to work really well. So if you're looking for a pair of those, then they seem to usually work out well. Um, I got this t-shirt. This was for Halloween and I love Pac-Man so I thought this was super cute. Again, this one's a little longer than the other one. It's kind of hard to see in the picture because I have black leggings on, but I just think this is super fun and again, super soft. This outfit or this top, it came with a pair of bottoms that are very, very uh, cheap looking. Let me show you. This is the underwear that it came with. Um, and then this is the top. So I got this to go to a In This Moment and I Signed Kills concert. And I really do like it. I think it's really pretty, but it's just a pain in the butt to kind of wear it. So the little contraptions here that hook on, they are really difficult to kind of snap into place. They just kind of 
lock in and then sometimes they unlock. So I would definitely put something underneath if you can, just like strapless. If you're going to wear this, it's kind of like a, cor well, it's corset. Um, but it's adjustable in the back. It has a lace. There's a couple pictures I'll show you. And I just thought it was really pretty because of the lace. And I love the red and just the overall look of it. So I will wear that at some point. I wound up wearing this to that concert with a pair of, um, oh my God, what am I trying to say? Um, leather pants. <laughs> Um, this top. So this is see-through. I had a onesie that was kind of like a beige color or like a camel color underneath of it. It was shiny. It looked really cute. Um, but this is really pretty. It's kind of not very cheap, I guess. I mean, it's the lace itself didn't feel like it was going to rip on me the whole time. So I like that. And it was really comfortable. It's a little stretchy. So there's some room in there, but really, really pretty lace top. I love anything with lace. All right, moving on, I did get these because I wanted to try them for the Excision concert coming up, and I I opened them up. Of course, my, I'm like, oh my God, like, <laughs> to go, I'm so excited. If you're gonna wear these, you can see them, you can see, but they're kaleidoscope glasses, so you basically just see color. If I was trying to walk into the concert or walk to get something, and I had to see, I could not keep these on because I would walk straight into something or fall off of something. So yeah, they're fun. They're really, really plasticky cheap. They basically just make everything bright and colorful. So yeah, I had to try them. I'm glad I didn't go to like one of the other websites that sells the uh, EDM stuff and get a really expensive pair. And unfortunately, right when I went to tighten them up, to make them a little bit tighter to my head. This silver part came right off and I put it back on, but yeah, so that was interesting. Um, I got this beanie because I kept seeing it show up, but when I got it, it's kind of like reminds me of a pillowcase. So it has this look to it. I like that it's white and gold. It's one of my favorite color combinations, um, but it's very, it just reminds me of a pillowcase. It's super soft, but I don't know. I haven't worn it. I don't know if I'm going to, but I couldn't stop seeing this print and I just fell for it. So I got that. These are so cute. I got these for work and they actually are perfect. So because we are using a scanner all day, you have to have your fingers. Some of the gloves that are geared towards like the touchless screen, they don't work with the scanner for whatever reason. And I saw these and they're really soft. They are very pillowy or they kind of have like the fuzz that just randomly comes off. So I got this pair and then a black pair. The black pair is in my work bag because I do use them. And for me, they work perfectly because the fingers are cut out. So that way I can use them with my scanner. So something actually came that was useful. Um, this is a pair of glasses and they came in a little case. And these are very heavy like they're like really heavy and I <laughs> could not resist because of this it's so gaudy I don't know if you can tell but I fall for all this gaudy stuff um I just like it so yeah but this is what they look like I don't know how often I'm going to be wearing them but I thought they were really cute because they have this pretty like floral detail on them and they did come in a little case so there's that this I kept seeing this. I love anything with blue crabs. And this was supposed to be like a little um, phone stand. And when I got this, I was like, are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> like, it's literally one of those things that you like, it's so it's really bad. I don't think it would hold anything up. I mean, it's a blue crab. It's cute, but it's useless. So there's that. This, I am, I have like a really childish sense of humor and I saw this. I think they have either a t-shirt or a hoodie with it and I want it too, but there's that. If you can see it. <laughs> I think it's really funny. I don't know. I'm easily amused. And then I got this one. It's a pin, by the way. And then I got this one too. And they're so inexpensive. I just thought it'd be fun to have them. 
Um, I grabbed some more perfumes because I am, I finally have enough to do that video. I, I don't know. I probably have like 10, if not more. I'm not sure yet. But this one kept coming up. It was supposed to be like a vanilla scent. It's just a cute little bear. And has, somehow they were like buy one, get one free. So I got two of them. Uh, so I'll save that for the review as well as this one is the coconut sunshine one and it looks like this and as soon as I smelled this I will just tell you to me it's straight up play-doh so I had someone I had a, actually a couple people smell this for me and tell me what they think and they all give me different opinions on what they think so I will be testing that one out and let you know this one I got is here this one is supposed to be like an uh, Olymp Olympia, Olympia, and it's just this Miracle Goddess. Super cute packaging. Um, I'll let you know. There's that. And then the last one I grabbed is my signature scent dupe is La Via Belle. I know that's like a lot of people's like just so over it, but I thought it was cute. It's like, it's like the spot on with the packaging. So there's that. I grabbed that one. Okay. <laughs> like I said, I have a very interesting sense of humor. I was Takashi69 for Halloween. So I grabbed these grills. They're like hip hop grills. They don't work. I mean, they, they're really hard to keep on. Um, but they look like this. And then they have little wax to keep inside of them, I guess, to keep them from bending. I will show you some pictures. I had a lot of fun with that one. My nieces took um, the necklaces that I had ordered and they broke like really quickly. So they actually have them. So I'll put some pictures on. For that costume I ordered, they are dirty because I have worn them. These neon um, shoes, they're actually pretty comfortable. Um, and like I said, they're dirty because I have worn them. If you wear them, expect to get a lot of, oh my God, that's so bright comments because they do come in. Um, but I got that for that costume and that outfit. And I just, I had a lot of fun with that one. And I got some more of the little signs. These were not in that protective little foam thing that the other ones, they just came together. So they are a little bent. Um, so this is really cute for Valentine's Day. It just says to my Valentine. I love this like old fashioned looking look. And then I grabbed this one, which I thought was really, really pretty. And it just says be my Valentine. Look how pretty that little girl's face is with the pink. So grab those. And then the last thing I have in here is one of my favorite things. It's very, it's not like super saturated in the color. It looks a lot more like that in the pictures when you order it, but I did get the Lisa Frank blanket because I love blankets and Lisa Frank is one of my all time favorite things. So really super cute. I'm glad that I got it. It's very, very inexpensive. It's pretty large actually, and it's warm, so it does its job. Um, but yeah, so that is everything I have for you in this video. I hope you guys enjoy this. Let me know what you think. Um, and yeah, I guess it probably won't be very long before we do another one. So I hope you all have a great, great rest of your day and I'll see you very soon in the next one. Bye.